the case, please. Good evening, everyone. Since the beginning of this, um, let's say, debate, you were saying, Mr. Nadim, that there is no media. The government, the Sudanese government, is not providing any media. So no one knows what's going on there. Well, let me tell you something. How come? How are you saying so if we are all sitting down here today and knowing exactly what's going on? How can you tell that? And apparently, you yourself know a lot and I'm, say, I'm telling you a lot about this. You've been talking since the beginning and you've been doing a great job. So apparently, yes, there is media and the media is, wearing, is yes. working properly. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yes. There are two media we're talking about. We're talking about Arab media and Western media. Western media, what they did, they go illegally through Chad, they go in, they film, they go out. Sometimes they are arrested because they went in illegally. Arab media is not allowed to go in. Did you watch anything, any footage on refugees in Darfur on the Arab channels? I haven't. It's very hard to find some. They don't exist. You have. They report on what's happening in the UN about Darfur and Look, Security Council and the She just wants to make a point. The point is knowing about the issue, right? Through Western media. Through Western, through but Arab. In, but in the Arab world, not everybody knows English. But Arabs do know. Sure, but not everybody, only the elite, it's, the normal people, as long the as Arab they know. street doesn't know about it because they don't, they don't Here you go again, no. you're saying they do not no. know about it. How come they know? Whether it's from the Arab or from the Western media, they, they know. They do know from the Western media, Thank we you. agree. They do know. All right. so, they, so we can take an action. Arabs can take an action. Hopefully, I really hope so. Okay, we are much. going to come to the point in the proceedings. We are now going to vote on the motion that this House believes Arab governments couldn't care less about Darfur. Would you take your voting machines? If you want to vote for the motion, that's the side represented by Ahmed Diraj and Nadim Hasbani, will you press button one, the yellow button? If you want to vote against the motion, that's the side represented by Sirajuddin Hamid Yusuf and Zaid Al Saban, would you press button two, the red button, and would you please do that once? In a few seconds, your vote will be transmitted to our computers, and we should have the result for you on the screen. All right, the results there, coming up on the screen. 81%, 81% for the motion, 19% against. The motion has been resoundingly carried. It just remains for me to thank our distinguished guests thank for you. making the journey here to Doha to take part in the debate. Thanks very much to you, the audience, for your questions. The Doha debate will be back again next month. Till then, from all of us on the program, have a safe journey home. Good night. Thanks for coming. Good night.